Think about your favorite restaurant, the one that depletes your hard-earned income. I'm willing to bet this restaurant always strives to be better rather than staying the same. They want the experience you relish tomorrow to be better than your experience today. I'd also bet that they are implementing a system to try and make that happen. This is Kaizen at play, and more importantly, it's how competitive businesses and people remain successful. So, what is Kaizen? You may have heard of it before, or maybe you've seen it in the culture of some companies and wondered what it's all about. Well, you're in the right place, as I'll tell you what it is, how to use it, and why it might just be the missing piece in your life's routine. So, we get Kaizen from two Japanese characters, Kai, which means change, and Zen, which means good. When you put it together, Kaizen means good change, and loosely translated, gives us continuous improvement. In fact, in Japanese culture, Kaizen is more than a business philosophy, it's a way of life. The basic idea behind it is that small changes can lead to big results. It's all about constant improvement through small daily actions taken over time to achieve our desired results. In other words, you don't have to do something big and dramatic to change your life for the better. In fact, those significant sweeping changes are often not sustainable over time because they're too overwhelming for most people. Instead, you can make small changes every day that, when combined together, add up to significant results over time. Kaizen considers all facets of life, personal health and wellness, work performance, and even relationships with family and friends. When applied correctly, this method has the potential to improve every aspect of your life without adding undue stress or pressure. However, effectively applying Kaizen's principles requires a firm understanding of its components and identifying which areas need the most immediate attention. Principles of Kaizen Kaizen is possibly best known for its role in the success of Toyota, the automobile manufacturing giant. Toyota was founded on Kaizen's principles and is now one of the top companies in the world as a result. Some of the guiding principles of Kaizen for personal development are Number 1. Focus on small wins Number 2. Commit to continuous improvement Number 3. Be open to feedback Number 4. Don't let setbacks stop you Number 5. Make your goals specific and measurable. The 5 S's of Kaizen This Japanese philosophy often uses a 5S framework to increase productivity, work quality, and safety of a person or business. The 5 S's are words we use regularly, but Kaizen puts a productive spin on them. These 5 S's are sort, set in order, shine, standardize, and sustain. Sort The Japanese word that defines sort in Kaizen is seiri which shows that unnecessary items should be discarded from the workplace, keeping only active pieces needed for the intended work. Set in order. In Japanese, it is known as seitan. Setting in order follows the sorting process because items found during this phase should be organized based on their importance. You can also arrange them with labels or colors based on their worth. Shine. This is seiso, and it shows the importance of keeping your workplace or home space cleaned regularly to prevent accidents. After all, not many people can thrive in dirty or unorganized environments. Standardize The Japanese word for this is seiketsu. This term is used to define the process of developing and implementing simple and clear standards. Setting your expected results will later enable you to establish guidelines for performance measurement of self-made and delegated tasks. However, before standardizing your environment, you must have followed the first three S's. Sustain also known as Shitsuke, speaks of commitment, and it stands for the adherence to the improvements made in the previous steps to see the intended results. Even though the 5S framework often springs up in official settings, it can easily be applied to your daily life and foster personal development. Therefore, you should always start by sorting out your thoughts, organizing scattered areas in your life, cleansing your mind, separating and categorizing areas that might trigger your slipping into old ways, and sticking to the commitment. And how does Kaizen work? You are probably wondering why this method produces as many success stories as it does. The answer is quite straightforward. Kaizen favors focusing on ongoing incremental changes over significant breakthroughs. It is about doing one change and one thing at a time until you've reached your desired goal. Its simplicity is the key element that makes it helpful. You don't need to learn new strategies or feel overwhelmed by advice from people telling you to do a million things at once. Just pick one thing to focus on and make it happen. If you have an area of your life that needs improvement, just ask yourself, what can I do right now to move in the right direction? It doesn't have to be something drastic. 
but it does have to be actionable, something you can actually do right away. A good example is the majority's New Year's resolution to eat healthily. Instead of overhauling your whole diet overnight, which could set you up for failure and ultimately result in binge eating sugar anyway, what if you focused on just one small part of your diet? That is how this philosophy works. The Kaizen Cycle is a five-part process for continuous personal and business development improvement. As an individual determined to be successful, this method should be used to 1. Identify a problem or area where you need to improve. 2. Create an actionable plan. 3. Implement the created plan. 4. Evaluate the results from your strategy based on key indicators. 5. Modify and apply the effects until they become a standard in your life. You can use this cycle to track your progress regularly and to make adjustments to ensure that your personal development journey stays on course. Among the many things we could learn from the Japanese, their focus on improvement can offer us much. The concept of Kaizen was introduced in post-war Japan as a part of a sweeping cultural change to bring out better productivity and quality control in the industry. Still, it has since flourished into an approach used by individuals and corporations. It is easy to get overwhelmed when focusing on a significant change, but you begin to realize that the little steps matter much more with Kaizen. So, how else do you intend to become better? Please let me know in the comment section below. If you learned something new today, please like and share this video with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications so you do not miss more videos of Millionaire Mind. We will see you in the next video. Take care.